All right, so you've traveled, if you've been traveling around St. Pete lately, it's really hard to miss the new raised platforms. Just so you know, they're about halfway through getting that job done. As 10 Tampa Bay's Bo Zimmer explains, it's a new express bus service connecting St. Pete to the beaches. For Tavares Chance, getting from St. Pete out to his job on the beach isn't always easy. I have four hours, uh, two hours there, two hours home. He's among the estimated 2,500 workers who commute out to the beach using the bus every day for work. How big of a difference is it out there on the beach? Uh a $6 difference. And while there's record demand for workers right now, for some, the bus commute just takes too long. Fry cooks, uh, grill cooks, uh, housekeeping, oh, but it's just, uh, people just don't have a way there. But all that could soon be changing. PSTA is expected to launch its new Sunrunner rapid transit service next summer. And now we have options to get them to and from work on time. Raised platforms are already going in with about 15 of the 30 stops now complete. They'll allow drivers to load passengers and even bicycles without lowering the bus, speeding up stops with dedicated bus lanes expected to go in beginning next year. Yeah, I think there's a buzz going around about it. Ken Houtman and his partner Kim own Chill Restaurant and Bar on St. Pete Beach. It's so hard to staff right now, so getting people to the beach is, it would it'd be a huge help. And it's not just the workers with rising rental car prices and Uber Ubers, sometimes in short supply, he says the bus service will allow visitors and even locals an easy way to and from many of our area's top destinations. We have a lot to offer on the beaches. There's a lot to offer in downtown St. Pete, and it's great to share that. Now we have another option to get them from downtown here or vice versa, too. I think it's, it's great for both sides. But not everyone is in favor of the new rapid service. The buses are 40 feet long and some worry they could clog up traffic. PSTA says, if anything, it will reduce traffic. The service is scheduled to be up and running by next July.